Cool. Yeah, this is going to be the next five days, ghost. <sighs> it's not even Halloween. Uh, so yeah, like I said, this is going to be a bit smaller. Because one, the season's smaller. So there's not a lot to talk about. And two, even though I do love, like, this series. It's mostly because I like the fact that you have the Horrible History actors. Which I'm not going to review Horrible History if anyone's going to ask. Because I haven't watched a whole series of that. I've just watched in and out for clips, moments, and individual things. And it was sort of like me when I was growing up. But I do love it. And I definitely over listened to a lot of the songs. But I liked the ghosts. And some of the ghosts and how they were set up, I absolutely love. I am annoyed because... Even if you look at multiple series, season one has six episodes. All of them have, if I'm correct, six episodes in it. Except each one of them has a sort of like Christmas episode past season two. Season one doesn't. And there doesn't have a lot happening compared to like season one, which either talks about lore or... Sort of like changing something with like the business, with like the assistant, sort of like new positioning, the car, the ghost following people, or the sort of stuff where it's like connections and LGBT representation with a with having that slowly develop. Season one doesn't have. A lot happening. But the only thing I want to say, 5432127, is the fact that one of the things that is different that I find really interesting, and it shows the US get, it shows like something really interesting that like we don't mind talking about legitimately having one person actually in the house who is somewhat of a murderer. They do bring it back later in the series, but I'm not going to talk about that until season five because that's roughly when it becomes relevant. Um, but I'm not going to mention too much about that. But overall, which is the idea... I'm not going to talk about the consequences, but the idea... That one of the ghosts, which is Julian, pushes her off. Which I have mentioned is different to the US one. Because the UK one is legitimately... Could have possibly been murderer. You could have had a ghost murderer. But the U... The sort of US one is legitimately an accident. A ghost pushed something off. They didn't see it. And hijinks ensues. The other thing, which I also would like to point out, I do sort of like, is in each one of the series, you have this sort of decapitated one. In the US, besides the beginning and one scene where it's like, someone's lost my head, he's not there for most of the stories. And I know, like, even in season one, he's not in it. He's still sort of in the background, which I feel like is more interesting of, like, just having one character who just... That's nothing. And just existed. That's what I think would be really more interesting. To like. Have the character someone in the background. But he. Someone disappears. Where does he appear for like a lot of the series. I don't know. But yeah. This is season one. Out of five. For the next one, two, three, four. Four more days. There's going to be four more days of this. So yeah. I hope you enjoyed. And good night.